welcome to vishwa bloom so today we are looking at class 9 functions aim 1 challenges okay let's start so this is aim 1 challenges the first question a is equals to bracket 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 and uh, flower bracket close so now we will do the first equation uh okay so this we will solve it each and everything will solve so we can uh, get an idea so now let's solve it so here is a first question cha uh challenges a union b so this u represents union and this represents intersection i think you know this and uh first we'll solve the first question first a is there right what are the numbers there in a first write it so in middle union symbol keep the union symbol here and then they asked b right to solve a union b so write the b information here so we have three informations then what are the same or uh, uh, common things 1 2 3 4 uh, in this 5 and 6 so like this and 5 uh, and 6 what are there you should write here um and this is the answer for a union b now next we will see b union c it is nothing but whatever value of b is there you should write here and put the union symbol and then whatever c for like 1 2 4 6 7 is there right so that information in c what is there uh, we should write here we should uh, write the information then we'll get the answer 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 whatever numbers are there here 1 to 7 is there so we should write that things i mean numbers mm. next is bracket a union b and uh, union c so already we solved a union uh, b so we should just solve union c that's all right so uh, write the answer of a union b here and then uh, write the c numbers whatever are there 1 2 4 6 and 7 are there right so write it here then you will get the answer 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 1 1 2 2 is not there so we should write 4 4 and 6 uh, 5 is the only one so you can write 7 so like this uh, you can write so next one is a intersection and bracket a uh, union c so first a intersection so what are the numbers of a 1 2 3 4 and 4 so write it there see instead of a you should apply the numbers here then they asked b union c already we did it right here so we got the answer also so write the answer here don't write again don't solve this stuff only write the answer whatever we got here then we'll get the answer so what is the answer 1 2 3 4 uh, because why 5 6 7 we are not taking because in first set we don't have 5 6 and 7 so in 1 2 3 4 we have here also 1 2 3 4 we have 
so whatever in first set is there in second set also it should be there so that's why we'll get the answer i think you understood this so the next one is a union and uh, b union um, c so we already did in that uh, previous thing so i wrote the numbers here and b union c also we did it and we solved it it's easy right so next one is a minus u uh, union c so whatever we wrote in a we'll write the numbers and b union c already we solved and write the answer here so if you see anything it's none so it's none and next one is a minus b union a minus c so first you write uh, a, a numbers and b numbers minus it a minus b okay and then you will get the answer 1 2 uh, then now so this is sorry b minus now we will do a minus c so write the numbers here whatever we saw so we will get here 3 so you write uh, this first equation if you take and this as second equation if you take uh, then you can write here right then the question itself is here so what is there so you whatever we got it you write mixed so that's all so now we will uh, solve the second question that is if mu is equals to 2 3 4 5 then a is equals to 2 4 and b is equals to 3 4 then uh, we should verify the following laws we have laws right uh, we have six laws i think so uh, we have uh, five laws uh, I'm confirming. So now let's. Uh, so the first question is a minus b uh, is equals to a intersection of b dash. Uh, up one symbol you can see right. That is dash. So this is called dash. Or you can uh, put this. This is called complement. Okay. Next uh, we should solve first a minus b. Then we can solve b complement. So we can get the answer very easily. <laughs> so first we'll solve a minus b. So that is nothing but uh, two comma four minus three comma uh, four. So if uh, we see common, it's four and four. So nothing is four is nothing but two right. So uh, if you do next b complement we'll find so first uh, there we have the values of mu also so you can write the value of mu here and next you can write uh, b what is b nothing but 3 comma 4 here is the information you can see i think so so if we find uh, uh, we'll get 2 and 5 and now we will uh, find the a so then uh, 2 comma 4 uh, intersection of 2 comma 5 then you will get the answer 2 next we will uh, go with a intersection b dash is equals to a dash u b dash so next uh, same way we will solve uh, and then uh, we will find uh, a dash uh, u dash u sorry b dash then uh, we will write the values whatever a is there we'll write here and b is there and we'll write here then we'll get the answer next we'll go to third question that is a union b whole dash is equals to a dash u dash uh, sorry intersection of b dash then first we should find a union b dash that is phi uh, you if you solve you will get first a value and b value then in middle intersection so i did directly so next a dash uh, intersection b dash then 3 comma 5 union 2 comma 5 then answer is 5 so both are equal so that we proved it 
आई थिंक यू अंडरस्टैंड विल डिस्कस थर्ड क्वेश्चन सो थर्ड क्वेश्चन इज नथिंग बट एन ए इज गोज टू टेन एन बी इज गोज टू ट्वेल्व सो हियर इज द प्रॉपर्टी so here is a property you can see we applied a property here so a uh, a union b is equals to nothing but we should apply the thing the numbers 10 plus uh, 12 minus 6 so the answer is nothing but 16 now we will do the fourth 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 question also now only that is nothing but here is the question you can see it's very lengthy so a u a Uh, n of a is equals to four. So these all are the values, and we should find this big equation. So that is nothing but if uh, you solve directly, it will come six plus two plus zero plus one is equals to four plus three plus two plus uh, zero is nothing but nine is equals to nine. It's nothing but R H S is equals to uh R H S. So next we'll go for. Uh, fifth question. So fifth question, you can do it here only. So I'll just draw it here. So one comma three dash a. It's uh c. And next one is this one dash a. And uh, Next one is also B, and one comma two comma three is four comma five is this, and six and A is not valid, so it's not there. Now next we'll do the sixth one. That's our last question. So factor of six. So the This is the question. Now we, sorry, this is the question. Now we'll find. Uh, so what is the factor of factors of six? So six factors. Uh, in one table six goes, in two table six goes, and in three table also six goes, and in six table also six goes. So, uh, write it here. Then, a is equals to one two three. One two three. And six n of a is equals to four because all if we count all are four total is four right so we will write here four and n of p of a a of is equals to two n two n is nothing but it's a formula as you know two n so here are four if two two power four is nothing but uh, wait a minute. So two power four is nothing but two into two into two into two. That is nothing but sixteen. So how many sets are there in uh, six? They are telling right. So there are sixteen sets. So this is our challenges. Next we'll discuss uh, class ten packages in the next video. So let's bye for now. Thank you.